Degenerative disc disease can lead to a narrowing of the central spinal canal or the lateral recesses of the neural foramina, leading to leg, back, and groin pain, weakness, and difficulty walking. Many patients with this condition find that their symptoms are relieved by leaning forward, such as when they lean forward on a shopping cart to push it. This is because spinal flexion associated with this leaning forward relieves the pressure on the nerve roots emerging from the spinal canal, which is the cause of their pain and other symptoms. Linaris Medical Devices has developed an interspinous process decompression device called the Spine Jack that can easily and non-invasively be placed between successive spinous processes in order to relieve the pressure on the nerve roots and pain associated with spinal stenosis in many patients. It has the added feature of an adjustment mechanism that allows it to be further extended even up to years after initial placement if the need arises. It can be made from a two-part plastic. The plastic in contact with bone has the same hardness or modulus of elasticity as that of bone, and the inner plastic is harder, allowing the loads to be borne without fracturing or wearing. Alternatively, this device can be built of current FDA-approved materials. The device is initially placed through the intervertebral ligament and placed into close opposition to the spinous processes at the affected spinal level. The device is then anchored into the bone of the spinous process using a novel flexible and strong patented anchoring system. One of the leading competing devices on the market created to treat this condition is seen here in a side-by-side -side comparison with the Linares Medical Devices Spine Jack device. However, a common failing of the competing device is that after a period of a year or two, the pressure from the hard metal in opposition to the bone causes bone resorption to occur, and the nerves again get compressed, negating the therapeutic effect of the device. At this point, the patient either has to live with the condition or undergo a more invasive procedure such as a spinal fusion. With the Linares Medical Devices Spine Jack, however, there's a simple solution available to the patient and the treating physician. Using a simple skin incision performed under local anesthesia only, the spine jack can be precisely adjusted and can be extended up to an additional 7 millimeters in successive years to relieve the compression again without the need for any additional invasive surgery whatsoever. This adjustment can be accomplished on an outpatient basis and with either a mild sedative and local anesthetic or simply a local anesthetic into the skin. The tool is inserted through the skin incision and into the receiving port built into the spine jack. Each turn of the tool results in an audible and tactile click, resulting in an additional half millimeter of extension per click. In addition to the single level spine jack device, the Linares Medical Devices patent also includes claims for a version of the device that looks like a ladder, as shown, and is designed to decompress two and three spinal segments. As can be seen here, the device is made from two halves. The half on the right side in this illustration has spikes that are designed to easily pierce through the intervertebral ligament that runs between successive spinous processes. The other half on the left has a U-shaped receptacle for receiving the spike and locking into it. The mechanism can be further adjusted at each level to be individually customized and provide the correct amount of distraction and decompression. For more information on the Linares Medical Devices Spine Jack and other innovative devices, please visit linares-md.com or email spinejack at linares-md.com.